How do you turn an alkene, a molecule with two carbons double bonded to each other, into a diol? That is, how do you add an OH to each of the carbons that's involved with the double bond? Well, one way is to use permanganate solutions. When you use permanganate and then add a basic aqueous solution to it, you can actually break open the double bond. Notice how I've rewritten it as a single bond here. And just add an OH to each of the carbons that was involved with the double bond. Here's what I mean. Here's an OH, here's an OH. Yeah, that's it. It's just done. For those of you who are really interested in how this kind of thing works, long story short, it's a syn addition. And what I mean is each of the OHs attaches itself or attacks from the same side. It's not like one coming from each side. It's both of them coming from the same side. And you do have hydrogens attached here. It's a syn addition. But what I want to show you is how this actually happens. Long story short, you still have those five carbons in a ring, but when you add the permanganate to the solution, or to the molecules, or whatever, wherever it's stored, the permanganate actually adds itself before any of the OHs play a role. The molecule itself actually looks like this. And then, once you add the hydroxide ions in aqueous solution, that's when you replace the permanganate, which is attached to each carbon, with an OH. In grade, whatever, 11, 12 chemistry, you're probably not going to have to know that. You're probably just going to have to know that it happens like this. But for those of you who are curious, the permanganate attacks the double bond, breaks it open first, and then the OH is replaced. It. It's pretty cool. Now, there's actually another way to do this with osmium tetroxide. That works just as well as permanganate does, but it's like really toxic and you gotta be careful, and it's just a huge mess all around. We prefer permanganate, but who knows? Your teacher might prefer osmium tetroxide. Who am I to judge? Anyways, you can break open a double bond and add an OH to each side to make a diol. Best of luck.